Hi everyone, welcome to the course on chemistry. In that, we are discussing about states of matter. In previous video, we have solved some problems based on Boyle's law, Charles law and Gay-Lussac's law. And also, from last 3-4 videos, you come to know how these gases will behave with variation in temperature, pressure, volume and number of particles. The gases which obeys all these gas laws under all conditions strictly are said to be ideal gases. Okay, so the gases which obeys Boyle's law, Charles law and Avogadro's law at all conditions strictly are said to be ideal gas. And today we are going to discuss about this ideal gas. So in these ideal gases, the intermolecular forces is not present. There is a absence of intermolecular force. In the ideal gases, intermolecular force irudella. Intermolecular force enirata zero irata, completely absent irata. And hence, these are able to obey Boyle's law, Charles law, and Avogadro's law under all conditions. Other kagina, a intermolecular force irlar dar samanda, in agatha, Boyle's law, Charles law, matu, Avogadro's law na, yalla condition olagunu, en markon thoktao, obey markon thoktao. Anga givukna venan theativi. Ideal gas and theory. Okay. So, here the gases which does not obey all these laws under all conditions are said to be real gases. If ideal gas and theory obey theory. And remember, these ideal gases does not exist in nature. In ideal gases, these ideal gases are not in nature. These gases you observe, maadthiri. for example, oxygen, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, all these gases does not obey all these laws under all conditions. Okay? All conditions are in nature. These gases are in Boyle's law, Charles law, Avogadro's law, and obey them. Okay? Hangagi, Hanta gases again Avena Thativi, real gases and Thativi. Okay? The gases which does not obey the Boyle's law, Charles law, and Avogadro's law at all conditions are said to be real gases. Okay? And there is a presence of intermolecular force in real gas. Real gases are again erata, intermolecular force present erata. But the ideal gases are intermolecular force in the complete agi absent. So now we will derive an equation which relates pressure, volume, temperature, and number of moles all together. Yalla yu pressure, volume, temperature, matu, number of moles of particles. Yalla kudiru antaha wanda equation na naven madunu derive madunu. Okay, so that equation which gives the relationship between these pressure, volume, temperature and number of moles is said to be ideal gas equation. I equation is now in the ideal gas equation. So, as you know, ideal gas obeys Boyle's law, Charles law and Avogadro's law. Boyle's law, Charles law and Avogadro's law. By combining the expressions of these laws, we will derive the ideal gas equation. A muru laws na combine maadi, na vayen ideal gas equation na derive maadu. So, according to Boyle's law, first we will take Boyle's law. So, according to Boyle's law, it states that Volume is inversely proportional to pressure. Volume, pressure is in inversely proportional in Then, the second law is Charles law. 
So according to Charles' law, V is directly proportional to T. Volume is directly proportional to temperature. Call this as equation 1 and this one as equation 2. This is equation 1 and this is equation 2 and this is equation 2. Then it also obeys Avagad Rose law. Matan the Allah obey Madatidu, Avagad Rose law obey Madata. According to Avagad Rose law, volume is directly proportional to number of moles and call this as equation 3. So an ideal gas obeys Boyle's law, Charles law, and Avagad Rose law at all conditions. Now combine these three equations. These three equations are the same. Combine them. So combining equation 1, 2 and 3, we get Am again see the three. More equations combine made that. Not just at the left hand side. Left hand side another V. In all equations we have volume, and hence in general, in common, I will take V. And it is a proportional to. Adu proportional other. Yaduka one by P according to Boyle's law. It is proportional to. 1 by P and directly proportional to T. So multiply it by T and also directly proportional to N. So write N here. Now I will take one constant by removing this proportionality sign. The proportionality sign remove one of the constant thing. and that is V equal to R T N divided by P. Here the constant is R and this R is known as universal gas constant. Universal gas constant. And its value is 8.314 joules per Kelvin per mole. R the value is 8.314 joules per Kelvin per mole. It is a constant and its value is 8.314. Now I will modify this equation by cross multiplying P at the left hand side. I will get PV is equal to, I will write first N, then R, then T. So PV is equal to NRT. This equation is known as ideal gas equation. E equation is known as ideal gas equation. Where P is pressure, V is volume, N is number of moles, T is temperature, R is universal gas constant. So remember this equation, the very important equation that is ideal gas equation, okay, which is PV is equal to NRT. Now, we will derive the equation for the system which undergo changes by pressure, volume and temperature. If you already have the ideal gas equation, that is PV is equal to NRT. This is ideal gas equation that you have already derived now. Now, let us consider a system which is filled with an ideal gas. Okay. When the system to one day, when the container to one day, other again other ideal gas other. And initially, the pressure on that ideal gas is P1. And initial volume is V1 and initial temperature is T1. Initial pressure another P1 another. Initial volume another V1 another. Initial temperature another T1 another. Initial lanthedra starting. Ik sadhyak. Yes, pressure P1 another. Volume V1 another. Temperature T1 another. 
and number of moles of gas will be n number of moles of gas yestada n ana now write the ideal gas equation for this condition ee condition ga ideal gas equation barire here what is the ideal gas equation pv is equal to nrt where p indicates pressure but for this condition pressure is not p but what p1 p iddalle yen barithini p1 anthu barithini and volume is v1 that is equal to n as it is r is also constant so r write it as it is and temperature is t1 okay so p1 v1 initial pressure and initial volume t1 is temperature let us call this as equation 1 and also we can modify this one as idanna yen martini modify martini so i will bring this t1 at a denominator what i will get p1 v1 divided by t1 is equal to nr okay t1 anna cross multiply madini so it will comes to denominator at left hand side and p1 v1 divided by t1 is equal to nr okay then now i will heat this system ಈ ಸಿಸ್ಟಮ್ ಅನ್ನ ನಾ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ಹೀಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀನಿ ವೆನ್ ಐ ಹೀಟ್ ದಿ ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಸೈಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕಂಟೈನರ್ ದಿ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಗ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ರೀಸಸ್ ಟು ಟಿ ಟು ಈಗ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಏನಾಗತ್ತ ಹೆಚ್ ಆಗತ್ತ ಹೆಚ್ ಆಗಿ ಅದರದ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಎಷ್ಟಾಗತ್ತ ಟಿ ಟು ಆಗತ್ತ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ತಿಳ್ಕೊರಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ರೀಸಸ್ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇನ್ಕ್ರೀಸಸ್ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಹೆಚ್ ಆಯ್ತು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ನು ಏನಾಗತ್ತ ಹೆಚ್ ಆಗತ್ತ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಗೇ ಲಿಸಾಕ್ಸ್ ಲಾ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ಇಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹೆನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಪಿ ಟು ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ಆಸ್ ಪಿ ಟು ನೌ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಇನ್ಕ್ರೀಸ್ ದಿ ಪ್ರೆಷರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಟೆಂಪ್ರೇಚರ್ ದೆನ್ ವಾಲ್ಯೂಮ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಚೇಂಜಸ್ ವಾಲ್ಯೂಮ್ ನು ಏನಾಗತ್ತಲ್ಲೇ ಚೇಂಜ್ ಆಗತ್ತ ಅಂಡ್ ಹೆನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಾಲ್ಯೂಮ್ let us take it as v2 a volume anna en antu kori v2 antu antu kori now at this condition what would be the ideal gas equation so when pressure is p2 volume is v2 and temperature is t2 what would be the ideal gas equation that is p2 v2 is equal to nr t2 because n remains same number of moles of particles will remain same na adakke extra gas add madilla starting est ittu ashta gas anna ittini so hangagi n en adari as it is ada r is constant and temperature is t2 now i will write this equation as p2 v2 divided by t2 is equal to n okay ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಪಿ ಟು ವಿ ಟು ಟಿ ಟು ನ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡಿನಿ ಅಗೇನ್ ಕ್ರಾಸ್ ಮಲ್ಟಿಪ್ಲೈ ಮಾಡಿನಿ ಡಿನಾಮಿನೇಟರ್ ಒಳಗ್ ಬರುತ್ತ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎನ್ ಆರ್ ನಾವು ಸಿ ದೀಸ್ ಟೂ ಇಕ್ವೇಶನ್ ಪಿ ಟು ವಿ ಟು ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಟಿ ಟು ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎನ್ ಆರ್ ಪಿ ಒನ್ ವಿ ಒನ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಟಿ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಎನ್ ಆರ್ ಸೊ ಕಂಬೈನಿಂಗ್ ದೀಸ್ ಟೂ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಪಿ ಒನ್ ವಿ ಒನ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಟಿ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು nr then what is nr nr is equal to p2 v2 divided by t2 so i will write it as p2 v2 divided by t2 instead of writing nr so this is the equation for a system which undergo certain changes in pressure volume and temperature and this equation is known as combined gas equation ee equation ge en anthe helthivi combined gas equation anthe helthe or general gas equation for a system which undergo changes in these pressure volume and temperature so by using ideal gas equation we can also derive the relationship between 
density and molar mass so now what is ideal gas equation pv is equal to nrt okay then what is n n means number of moles and how you will calculate the number of moles number of moles number of moles is equal to n that is equal to given mass divided by molecular mass molecular mass or molar mass and now the given mass it is indicated as small w and molar mass is indicated as capital m so n is equal to w divided by m now substitute this value in equation 1 ee n value na equation 1 olage en maadri substitute maadu avage en sigutta pv is equal to n n anthe helidire illa enada w divided by m w divided by m into r t okay now i will cross multiply this v and m so what i will get p is equal to w by v r t into m okay v na en maadini ille denominator thon bannin right hand side okay avaga en sigutta w by v r t divided by m so simply see this idanna nodri ena indicate maduttidu w by v w andre mass v anthe helidra volume what is mass by volume mass by volume is equal to density anthe helidre mass per unit volume mass anthe helidra rashi volume anthe helidra gatra ಎರಡನ್ನು ಡಿವೈಡ್ ಮಾಡಿದಾಗ ನಮಗೆ ಏನ್ ಸಿಗುತ್ತ ಡೆನ್ಸಿಟಿ ಸಾಂದ್ರತೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತೇವೆ ಸೊ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ರೈಟ್ ಪಿ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಇನ್ಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ ಬೈ ವಿ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಡಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೆನ್ಸಿಟಿ ಅಂಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ರಿಮೈನ್ ಡಿ ಆರ್ ಟಿ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಎಂ ಓಕೆ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ ಬೈ ವಿ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ಒಳಗ ನಾ ಏನ್ ಬರ್ದಿನಿ ಡಿ ಬರ್ದಿನಿ ಡಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಡೆನ್ಸಿಟಿ ಅಂಡ್ r is constant and t is temperature m is molar mass so this relation gives or this equation gives the relationship between pressure and molar mass okay p is equal to dr t divided by m okay that gives the relation ship between relationship between density and molar mass density and molar mass so remember this equation one of the important equation okay